Okay, we got the Marauder out here in the grass. We're gonna give it a whirl. I got the standard battery in it. Um, earlier I did try, I did try the three cell in it, and you could smell some burning on the motor a little bit. You know that that like it was working too hard. So my suggestion is don't use a three cell on this, even though the ESC says two or three cell. It doesn't necessarily mean that the motor can handle it. I didn't like the way the motor smelled when I was going through the grass here. But uh, it'd be, be a great trailing vehicle to do trails. So this is a stock battery. It did fly pretty good though with that 11, 11 point some volt, volts on the three cell. So and it and it works it works pretty good on the the lipo. So let's let's just open it up here and I'll show you. I don't know what the other models of these have, but I'll shut it off, unplug the battery if I can. Okay. So now here, let's see maybe if this camera will pick it up. I don't know. There's a jumper right here. There's two of them actually. One's for racing. You, you put one on to the right, you can't go in reverse for rules in racing. But you pop this one over here for lipo. That jumper there, so now we're set up for lipo. We'll put the 7.4 lipo in compared to the 7.2 NIMH one. And this thing goes pretty good with a lipo in it. Put a couple clips in here. I mean, you're not going to get no oohs and ahs with this, but like I said, this would be a good trailing. If you want to do some trails, sure, hop right in here, your buggy, and take her out on the trail. Okay, so I forgot to turn it on, so let's click this on here. There we go. So now we're uh, now we got the two cell lipo in there. It's a little more spunkier. You know, grass is always going to bog down in your battery. Eh, don't go too bad. too bad so like I said I already had the three cell in it and I could smell some burning so my suggestion is you don't want to run a three cell in this this brushed version you only want to run a two cell and it's quite capable of handling the two cell it's only 0.2 volts higher than your your standard NIM battery so so you'll be all set if you guys want to want to run those in this I don't think you're gonna have any issues with it all right gotta go bye bye bye